Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two i love to get the positive feedback and if you feel like you resonate with my video give me a thumbs up like and even share it'll greatly be appreciated and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today to see what's up and go ahead and you know feel free if you feel like you want to express something that you're going through especially when it comes to the content of the video that i'm speaking of drop me a line drop me a line go ahead and to my returning subs, what up fam? Much love and light, namaste, love and blessings, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for the support once again and come and see about me today. Today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey Oka's in our crazy wisdom. Yes, today I'm listening to Happiness Frequency Feel Better Instantly with the vibe. I have never been able to pronounce this word worth nothing, but you know, forgive me if I mess this word up. By Binarial, binarial Beats for the serotonin release. So if, the, if it's pronounced a different way, my bad, I'm sorry. So I'm sorry if I murdered that word like that. But yes, I was reading about this article today, and I mean, it really got me, like, I was thrilled, like, I was so thrilled, like, if, if this is not written for me, this is crazy, because it's like, when we do things, it, it's like when we, we get to know people, and we come across people, we're like mirroring the things that, you know, open up, you know, there's things that are more than just you me you know black white you know asian african-american latino uh, you know european anything like that there's more than us out there there's more than us that, when it comes to the spiritual world you know and it's like lately i've been so open up like i told you in a couple of my videos my third eye has been opening up and i've been receiving so many blessings lately it's not even funny and just to know it, it, it's just a good feeling when I can get new family coming in and saying yes 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 you know I resonate I resonate girl you you know you did it you know you you made some vi you came out here and there's a reason why you have made these videos I said yes every time you know, I feel up in my spirit. It's like I feel like I'm a preacher or something, you know, not though I'm a preacher, but, you know, it, it's just like I feel up in my spirit. And it's like, you know what, you need to make this video. And it's just me being me. That's all it is. It's just me being me. But as being who I am, it's like I've experienced so many crazy things. It's like we're so chaotic and we're so, and I, I mean, the way they I read it, it's like we're misfits, but in a good way, we're crazy in a good way. You know, somebody's like, oh, you crazy. But yeah, in a good way. You know, that's how we are. We're able to ruffle somebody up with our humor. We have dark humor sometimes. Somebody, some people don't un understand it because we can be complex at times. You know, and there are some people, if they're really sincere, like I was reading, and they said, if you're really sincere, you when you come across a Hayoka, you'll feel the ease and the release of, you know, you, know, you got that clarity like, wow, you know, it, it'll feel so euphoric like it, it's like a natural high to you like you know this this person has opened up so many things that i was trying you know that is that miss, missing piece to the puzzle like my friend jake brown said you know missing piece to the puzzle and it's like when we're going through all these different emotions and you know we're coming across all these different people and there are some people you know that might felt you know they said that you're being there's some people that come across to us and they might be intimidated irritable you know, we'll, we'll bring emotions to the surface. Like, it can be good, it can be bad, but we'll bring it all out to the surface for them to be able to look. This is on your plate. These are the things that that you're dealing with right here. <laughs> and that's what it is. It's like they're, they're getting this emotional plate, and we're putting all this up in the front forefront for them to have to deal with. And then we go about our business. And it's like... 
it's a blessing to be able to see the things that I might be mirroring to the, towards somebody or somebody might be mirroring towards me. And there might be some things that I love about this person. And there might be some things like, oh my gosh, if this is me, um, you know, I really want to change that. You know, or this person has such this, you know, and I always find a good in somebody. You know, I always find a good in somebody. Because there are some people that we do attract and they're narcissistic. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, why do I have to keep getting these people, you know, because it's like when I was reading, and it's just like finding some more stuff about us, and it's just like, we have this crazy humor, it's like, we're, we're always bringing, uh, you know, an uproar, you know, and then some people will ruffle their fe feathers just to let them know, you know, think outside the box, you know, and it's just so many people I've been coming across lately, it's like the frequencies are really crazy, like if it's um, a good experience, it'll bring up emotional things like they're happy they feel feel so much clarity and or if it's something negative it'll bring out some anger jealousy envy or something like that but they'll recognize it they might not want to you know bring it to the attention they know but they don't want the other person to know and it's okay you know, and it's all there, but it's just something that we all need to do. Because, I mean, there's sometimes, I'm not going to even lie, you know, when I think about my family and there's certain people that will bring that out of me, like when I think about my family and I had to learn to deal with that, you know, I would think so negative and I would talk so negative about them. And I know I had to, you know, I have to change that. And I'm, I'm being vulnerable with y'all. I tell y'all, I'll be honest about that. Because that was a hard pill for me to swallow that my family had altered my life. They had changed my life. They had played with my mind. They had played with my memories. You know, I wasn't able to know my family. You know, my family doesn't really know about me. You know, they probably know certain things about me, but it's negative because this is what story they had planted, you know, to keep me and my family apart. But it's like, I'm walking in my truth. I'm not going to be quiet no more. I'm going to go ahead and say what I have to say. You know, because it brought me to where I am, making my videos, letting people know. You know, recognize the things that you need to heal from. I'm doing it now. I know the things that I need to heal from. I know my weaknesses. I know my strength. I know my confidence. I know my insecurities. You know, and it, it's just like, when I'm able to recognize these things and not be ashamed of how I feel. Or where I come from. I walk in my truth. I don't have time to be worrying about what people think of me. Or what people perceive of me. But as long as you're getting a lesson out of something that I'm bringing to you. Because some people are not grateful for that. You know, when you're coming across people, they, you know, you get tired of being, you know, you know, you want to be positive. You want to be good. And you want to be happy. But you always felt like you've been robbed of something. You know, a, a person, when you are in, into that negative state, you have obviously been robbed of something, robbed of your happiness, robbed of your, your virginity, robbed of your, you know, your innocence. Something has been robbed from you to put you in that negative state to where it can cause addictions, it can cause depression, it can cause anxiety, it can cause suicidal thoughts. But it's like when we take that away, and we recognize, you know, heal from this. This is not who you are. You know, yes, this did happen to you, but it's not happening to you. It's already happened, you know, but you, there's nothing you can change about that. All it is is you can learn from it. You can be an advocate for it. And you can probably help somebody out by letting them know, even though it doesn't have to be in a negative way, because there are sometimes, like I said in the past, I put out some videos, and I didn't mean to make anybody feel in a negative presence about me, because it was me being emotional, me being vulnerable, but this is what, you know, you had to see with me, this is my journey, I want you to be able to see me when I'm sad, I want you to be able to see me when I'm happy, I want you to be able to see me when I'm, you know, feeling so grateful, which I'm grateful every day. When you know you can wake up the next day and know you're on a, a better process or a progress of being a better person, that's all That's all you need to do. That is all you need to do. And it's just, you know, when we're doing our little, you know, our crazy wisdom and we do this in just a chaotic way sometimes, and some people don't get us because we'll march around things just for you to be able to, you know, expand your mind a little bit. Think outside the box. Because we'll tell you something that's like, dag, it might sound crazy, but it makes sense. So, 
but I'm not trying to hold you up. I was just feeling all up in my good fit. So I was just like, yeah, I need to make some more videos. I'm reading up on stuff. And it's just, I love to read up on things because I have a curious mind. And I love to expand my mind because I know there's more things out there than us out here. There, there might be aliens. People get crazy and just like, you know, this didn't happen. You know, this is not happening. You never know. If God can create us or whoever decide to make us or whatever, because people say God didn't make us and some people don't, but I'm not getting into that religious stuff. I'm a very spiritual person, but I'm not religious. So, but um, that's another story. But I'm just saying, you know, we're all here for a reason. It's just like when you're, you're a hell, God gave us this gift for a reason. And we need to be able to use it in the best way possible. You know, and there's some people we're going to meet that's going to come off negative. And there's going to be some people that you're going to inspire that's going to just melt your heart. Like, you you, you know, when you're coming up to me and tell me these, these comments, and it just really opens my heart to read your comments. And I'm so grateful for that. You know, especially the long ones when you get deep into it. I love those. Because it gives me something good to read to open up to know, you know, who my extended family is, how they work, you know, how they go about things. But I'm not trying to hold you up. I will talk to you on my next video. I will keep you in your my prayers. And I hope you do the same for me. And send out as much love and light and positive frequency as possible. And I will see you on my next video. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Even drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback. And I will see you on my next video. 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 Peace. Love ya. And be wild.